Welcome back to Sia TV and your update for the week of March 10th. Development updates are drawn from Sia's public GitLab. Two issues were closed, five issues were created, and seven new pieces of code were merged into the core code base. Contributors included David, Eddie, Chris, Matt, Steve, and Zach from the Sia core team. Public testing of Release Candidate 3 for 1.4.0 has revealed some issues for renters using the Windows version. The team is currently working on fixes and we appreciate your patience during this time. Remember, this is true distributed cloud storage, and it's not always easy. Meanwhile, Chris fixed a bug that could throw a panic while shutting down Saya. David and Chris worked on bugs related to writing logs during file repair checks. Matt optimized file chunk repairs. And Eddie updated the Saya website, notably the first links under slash learn and pushed updates to the Saya API docs. And finally, community member Hakane released a UI version of Decentralizer and updated the 1.0 version of its CLI tool. Decentralizer is an app that allows renters to micromanage their contracts, detect and avoid hosting farms, manually select hosts, and geofence their hosts' locations. It is free and open source. Get the full list of SIA changes and updates on GitLab. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next week.